This review is of Big Tree Farms Organic Cocoa Aminos Marinade and Sauce Original Flavor. It is soy-free, gluten-free, or USDA organic, non-GMO, 30, uh, Whole30 approved, um, let's see, paleo, um, no refined sugars, fair trade, regeneratively farmed. Um, this is made with what you in Indonesia is called nira. And that means the nectar of the coconut flower. And that's better for you than the um, coconut oil uh, because it doesn't have all the saturated fat of coconut oil. Um, and so here are the, and it's organic coconut blossom nectar. And actually, it, when, they, when they extract uh, this nira from uh, the coconut, uh, well, they'll cut the stems of the flowers to allow it to drip out. And this stuff, if it's left long enough up there on the tree, especially with the heat, um, which isn't as bad as uh, Ohio heat, but it's it's okay, <laughs> hot enough, um, that will actually start fermenting right in the cup the same day that it's been, you know, in, so you can just leave it for a while and it'll turn into alcohol. Anyways, nutrition facts and ingredients and uh, Balinese sea salt, don't think that really means anything, but this is made from Java. Uh, or um, in Indonesia, which is one of the larger islands, and it's the island that has the capital of Indonesia on it. So the downside, of course, of this is that it's got 500 milligrams of sodium per tablespoon, so this is a high sodium. Um, also, it's got 35 calories, so it's not too bad in terms of calories. No fat, uh, and no cholesterol. Uh, the carbs are only eight. No fiber, though, um, and six added sugars no protein so you know is this healthful well compared to something that's got a co uh, coconut oil in it um and has all the you know the same amount of sodium yes and obviously you know being that it's got all these nice qualities about it you know gluten and soy and, and us or usda organic and all this other stuff that is definitely a plus and uh let's go ahead and taste it and see if it's actually enjoyable I'm not going to take a big amount because I made the one mistake once of doing that with a soy sauce or something. It was really, really concentrated. Oh, yeah. So that definitely reminds me of the flavor of coconut sugar, which is made from the nira um, or made from coconut water. Um, so this has got a unique flavor to it that you probably would be hard pressed to find um, in other products. So I definitely would suggest, you know, giving it a try, using it for a marinade or sauce or whatever. Um, don't use too much because of all the sodium in it. But if you want to know what coconut sugar actually tastes like, this will, in terms of the sweetness, the flavor of the sweetness, uh, will actually tell you that um, or demonstrate that to you. So um, it wasn't exactly what I would thought it would be it would taste like, but it is, it does remind me of my life in Indonesia for 15 and a half years. So that's kind of nice. So I'm going to give this a seven and a half. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you have a great day.